We are genuine with every step we take. We are united and stay strong with every obstacle that comes our way. Our tenacity is what makes us great. Our integrity is what keeps us grounded. We nurture all who enter our halls. And strive for excellence in all that we do. And that means to be very passionate about what you want to do. So our tenacity is what makes us great. The I in Gassine stands for integrity, and that means to do the right thing even when someone isn't looking. So our integrity is what keeps us grounded. The N stands for nurture, and it's how we take care of one another when one falls down. So we nurture all who enter our homes. The E stands for excellence, which is trying our best every single day. So we strive for excellence in all that we do. We are Gassine. This is what we're going to strive by. This is what we want to do every single day. So instead of just coming to school just because we have to, we have a purpose now. Okay. So do you guys want to read it together? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Yes. Okay. Ready? We are continuing with every step we take. We are united and stay strong with every obstacle that comes our way. Our tenacity is what makes us great. Our integrity is what keeps us grounded. We nurture all who enter our halls. We strive for excellence in all we do. We are Augustine. How can you implement the Augustine Creed in your classroom? I would implement the Augustine Creed in my classroom by having it posted so all students could see it. Also, we would practice it daily along with the Pledge of Allegiance and practice it throughout the day so that they could carry it on through the rest of their schooling at Gustine Unified. Perfect, thank you. Mm -hmm. I think it will influence them by teaching them what the creed stands for, the importance of how we are part of Gustine, and we're just gonna start from the little guys, the kindergartners, and make it all the way strong, so by the time they're seniors, we are one big family. Okay. As an administrator, how can you implement this at your school? So as the administrator of Romero Elementary School, uh, I believe the creed will help us become united and strong by building our school up, showing students that we continue to build upon each other and support each other. Um, our students show tenacity every single day. They work hard in the classroom. They never give up. And out in the playground, we continue to nurture each other and support each other. Um, all teachers are involved in every aspect of our children's lives, so it helps support and nurture them. Um, we are a school of excellence, and our teachers are excellent teachers, and our students are excellent students. So we're very proud. Mm -hmm. How do you stay strong in the classroom? Um, when sometimes it's tough, I take a deep breath and don't give up. We we stick with each other. We don't like go apart, and we go do stuff together, and we don't like give up at anything. How will you practice the creed with your staff and students? So this year, um, we started a new motto school-wide, and it's called success is the only option, whatever it takes. After listening to the creed, I think the characteristics of each letter in the word Gustine will likely be the tools that we use to accomplish that motto. So if every child is to be successful, it's going to take, off the top of my head, tenacity, nurturing, a, a commitment to excellence that needs to continue to be developed and if it can be done with the We Are Gustine idea being brought from the high school, coming down to the middle school system and then ultimately down to the elementary school system, that's exactly the type of day-to-day -day components that I'll continue working with my staff and then ultimately the students to make happen on a day-to-day -day basis so that we here at the middle school can achieve our goals of success being the only option. Perfect, thank you. Okay, ready? <laughs> <laughs> to me, the creed means it shows that we can make our own kind of, our own saying even though our names kind of different. It's not very easy to make something out of, but we can still make something out that means a lot to everybody here. Ask him. 
Okay, what is an example of genuine? Well, an example of genuine is that our school, we pick up after ourselves, we go around, and we help others when people fall or when people get in trouble, we try to help them out or something like that. Um, is there a time when you experience integrity? Um, yes, every day, because here in Gustine we are true, and if we do, we always do what's right, no matter what, and that is what makes us Gustine. Oh, good. What are some words that stand out the most to you in the Gustine Creed? Um, I'm looking at nurture, I think, at the middle school. Our job is to nurture all students, uh, make sure they belong. Um, tenacity, I think with anything you do, you need to be aggressive, you need to give it your all. And united and strong and genuine, they're all pretty strong words. I think you need to be genuine with our program. We're trying to teach kids to give back this year and do for others. And as it were, a team. And so we're going to do everything together and make sure Gustine Middle School is a great place to be. Yes, thank you. <laughs> okay, how do you think the Gustine Creed will impact the middle school? Um, I think that it will definitely have a positive effect. I think it's going to be something that the students can kind of rally behind. And overall, it gives them more of a purpose why they're coming to school as opposed to just a place that they have to come to every day. It gives them motivation, it gives them a guiding light, and will allow them to stay focused and hopefully uh, succeed in their time here in middle school. What impact do you think the creed will have on your school? I think it'll have a very positive impact on our school pride and school spirit, and also connecting the schools together as a school community. Perfect, thank you. You're welcome. In this is we are united and stay strong. Um, the other part of it is our tenacity is what makes us great. So those are for me because not only am I the counselor for the district, you know, helping students at every level with social skills and development, but also uh, I'm part of the varsity uh, staff as a football coach. And so for me that means a lot um, in terms of students being successful in the classroom and, and in our community. So, Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. What does United and Strong mean? Okay. Is this rock strong? <laughs> Sunny, who is this? I got this at I got to find him. What does United and Strong mean? That's an evidence. That's for evidence strong. Is your shirt strong? No. Is Spider Man strong? No, no. That's sure. But I got to find him. Oh yeah. Good job. Ready? Okay. So how can you implement the creed in your athletics? Um, I'm aggressive and I, I um, try to stay in all game. Perfect. So you're united and strong with your teammates? Yeah. Perfect. And do you have strive for excellence? Do you guys try to win every single game? Yeah. We won our first four in 19 and nothing. Wow. That's excellent. Thank you. Go. Can you explain a time whenever you've been genuine? At the basketball game? Yeah. Uh, I, I wanted them to win, didn't want them to lose. And why? Because uh, I care. Mm -hmm. And you wanted Gustine to win, right? Yeah. Can you guys let me know an example of when you guys were united at any point? Well, uh, yeah. When my friend Maria fell, we, had, we stayed together as mm -hmm. best friends like we always were. Yeah. And we we helped her because uh, she had the stitches here. Everyone's like, oh, what happened and all that, and everyone was just cr crowding her. Yeah, and she didn't. And she, like the boys were just. And she didn't want to talk about it because it made her feel like sad and yeah. made her feel sad. Mm -hmm. So do you think it's important to be united? Yeah, yeah. I do. Corrections. I know. Fine. Why is it important for the high schoolers <clears throat> to go to the other sites to explain the creed? I think it's very important that our students from the high school go down to the lower grade levels to model uh, our spirit and our creed reflects our spirit not only at the high school but in the community at large. Uh, so when the students do eventually come here, they've already got a foundation of our creed and our school spirit. We are Gustine. 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 We are Gustine.